here we have the 555 timer. You see it's oscillating. What you have to have is a power going to pin 8, resistor on pin 7 to pin 8, resistor from pin 6 to pin 7, pin 6 has to go up to pin 2, which is this wire here, capacitor from pin 2 to ground, 1 is at ground, 3 is your output, and you need to usually need a resistor to control the flow power and uh, this particular one runs on 5 to probably 15 volts but I'm using 9 volt battery right now this is an alternate form of oscillator using two transistors two capacitors and uh, four resistors the capacitors here is uh, 10 microfarads uh, you should increase it to 47 and um, I'll put the circuit here. It's not that perfect. That's why I use the 555 timer. It's one that's going to stick. I didn't have the exact components, so I had to uh, put two 225 